Hi friends, what's up? This is Deep Basu, and I'm back once again, and I'm going to review this series. It's a very interesting series I watched on Amazon Prime yesterday. The name of the series is Wedding dot com. I really love the title. I love the maker, how the makers have crafted this title, Wedding dot com, and I like the poster image they have uh, designed. You, when you see it, you'll understand what I really mean. So, wedding dot com. Uh, the entire series basically talks about matrimonial fraud. The entire series, five part series, around thirty five or forty minutes each per episode, uh, basically revolves around five women of different age, and how all of them were fell prey while searching for their life partner. looking for the ideal match on the matrimony side they fall prey to matrimonial fraud so overall the chronicles are pretty sad It means the like uh, if you hear the stories it's pretty sad and unfortunate how these women how these fraudster you know duped each and every women it's quite sad it really shatters someone so definitely i i could empathize i could really understand and definitely I was quite moved by seeing that even um, see, frankly speaking, I usually have I've heard such things happen on dating apps. Like if you watch the series on Netflix called Tinder Swindler, but on a matrimony side, I didn't know much about it. It happens, of course, but the series was quite an you know, eye opener for me. How men very confidently, not only online, even offline, men quite confidently they swindle, they dupe. young women my god and i'm sure it, it really leaves a scar in their life because you you do feel very shattered when you have invested so much time you 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 share a lot of things with someone knowing that they will be your life partner but unfortunately those are they end up becoming a fraudster or they dupe you it's definitely very sad so the series is quite sad and unfortunate is very well made directed by tanuja ma'am and has been produced by bbc but somewhat i felt that the overall tonality was quite serious they have approached it with uh, a lot of seriousness but somewhat i felt that it could have been dug more into the the stories the more insights because most of the stories are quite uh, incomplete i found i think one story gets completed anyway i won't give out any more spoilers but overall the story film begins the series begins on a really interesting note and a, a properly very apt like a crime docu drama how it unfolds everything is so good but somehow i felt that it could have dug deeper into more insights more information more cases somehow i felt unsatisfied when the series got over i wanted to see much more maybe i'm so influenced by western docu series where there's so much gore there's so much Uh, you know, more more things, much more things happening. So I was really hoping that even the series, uh, Curry and Sinai, it was so well made, and what a finish! So I somewhat felt that the series, the finishing, could have been more impactful, much better. It just ends on a very open-ended note. Anyway, do watch it. It's very well made. I am a big fan of Tanuja Ma'am's work. So yeah, this is my review for Wedding dot com. do watch it and it's quite an eye opener and definitely you will get to see a lot more and you'll get to know a lot more what really happens which i was not quite aware so guys watch wedding.com